Hey there crew, my name is Captain Geronimo and welcome to yet another episode of Star Trek Online News. In today's episode, a thief. In today's episode, a con man. In today's episode, a smuggler. In today's episode, a well-established and respected merchant. Hardcore Phantom, Harry Mud, comes to us with a brand new offer. Muds Into Darkness and Beyond Pack, as well as Mega Pack. What are those? Okay, uh, let's start with prices. This bundle can be found in the Zen store and it's going to cost you 29,500 Zen. But from June 10th up to June 24th, you can find this thingy for 50% off. Okay, what does it contain? This bundle contains 8 different things and you can only claim 3 of them, 3 out of 8, for the amount of money that you give. So what are your options? We can split the bundle into two different rows. So let's say that row number one are gonna be ships while row number two are gonna be items. So row number one, we have four different ship choices. On spot number one, we have Kelvin Intel Dreadnought, better known as the Vengeance class, which can be found in the Lobby store. That's your first choice. Your second choice is called Kelvin pack number one. This pack contains not one, but three different logbox starships seen in the Kelvin timeline universe. These are Kelvin Romulan Talaru class, Klingon D4X class and Federation Constitution class. Next up we have Kelvin pack number two. This Kelvin pack number two contains Kelvin timeline heavy destroyer, which is known as the Einstein class, better known as USS Kelvin, the first ship seen in Star Trek XI, and second ship is Klingon D7 Heavy Destroyer. Your fourth option is Vulcan Scout Vessel, better known as Spock's Jellyfish. These are the ships. Now, let's sweep to the bottom row. We have four different items. Item number one, nine experimental starship upgrade tokens, so meaning you can get nine tier 6x tokens. Two tokens which are going to give you 100% discount to any tier 6 starship from the Zen store. So any two tier 6 starships from the Zen store for free. Item number three is Epic Phoenix token. This token is going to allow you to purchase any epic item from the Phoenix store or you can just trade it and get lower grade marks but I presume that you know everything about that. And finally the fourth one, Master Keys, 50 of them. So out of the 8 items that I just named, for the price of 29,500, please do mind the discount period, you can choose only 3 of them, choose wisely. Also, there is going to be a Mega Bundle drop. What is a Mega Bundle drop? Basically, the Mega Bundle is one-stop purchase. You will get all eight items, however, the price is going to be a drastically different. This pack is going to cost 60,000 Zen, but it's going to be on 50% discount, same as the previous pack. Okay, let's talk about ships, because ships in here are quite different and specific regarding one single thing. So, Vengeance can be purchased in the Lobby store. Kelvin pack number one, Kelvin pack number two ships from these two packs, and Vulcan Scout Vessel, they come from log boxes or promo boxes, or basically they are they're from some kind of a loot box. And they're quite hard to get if you're trying to open the boxes with the keys. And also, if you get the ship from the box, you only get it for one character. They're not account unlocked. So you get it on one character, only that character can use it. But if you purchase the ships in this pack, they become account unlocks. So meaning 
you get a vengeance for a single character, you can unlock the vengeance on all of your characters. This is a drastic change and it's a very, very cool change. Now, to talk about the ships, Kelvin Intel Dreadnought is, in my opinion, still one of the better ships that you can get within game. It has a high tactical orientation, it's extremely powerful, however, it's very slow, it's massive. And because it's massive, it has a very, very big potential to stay alive. So it's basically a heavy cruiser in combination with some sort of a escort, I would say it like that. It's a dreadnought. It's a real, real dreadnought. Ships from Kelvin Pack number one are basic cruisers. I'm not too big of a fan of them, but as a cruiser, they can pass. Calvin Pack number two. These two destroyers are extremely potent. They're small, they're fast, they're aggressive, they're very powerful. Their consoles and experimental weapons, everything about them screams power, they screams aggression, superiority. Extremely good if you're a tactical player. Finally, Vulcan Scout Vessel. Very teeny tiny, extremely fast, maneuverable. Uh, it comes with quad, photon torpedo launcher on the forward side. Uh, it's not really powerful, but it can be quite fun, especially if you equip uh, high yield or torpedo spread. It's going to just be a massive volley of torpedoes flying from your ship, but it's basically useless. You can fire them like every two seconds but they're they're weak so let's call them like that but ship is a ship it's it's a very good ship quite nice console so you can see the reviews of all of those starships on my channel if you're interested uh, just mind that some of the reviews of these ships can be older so the quality won't be as good as right now now for the items nine experimental starship upgrade tokens for the tier 6x very good very nice uh, i love it Two tier 6 starships from the Zen Store for free. If you had an eye for a Zen Store starship or two, this is a perfect opportunity to get them. Epic Phoenix token. You can reclaim some of the items that have been long gone or you haven't been able to get. Or you can just decrease that epic one to the normal one and just got a bunch of Phoenix upgrade tokens. And then finally, Master Keys. We all know what they're here for, what they do. Now, Mud is a con man. Uh, as I said, you cannot get, let's say, Kelvin Pack 1 three times in a row. Why not? Because these are account unlocks. You get, let's say, Kelvin Pack number 2. You get those two starships for all of your accounts. There is no need to purchase Kelvin Pack number 2 like three times in a row. So, once you get any of the ships from the pack, you can just cross them. You have other free ships to choose from or any of the items. So, but the items, you can get them how many times you want. I mean, you can get up to three. So, you can get, let's say, two Phoenix tokens, one Master Key, three Master Keys, or uh, three times two tier 6 starships from the Zen store, or let's say, one experimental ship token and two times master keys, so that will give you 100 master keys. You have to think like this, you're going to give 29,500 Zen for free items. And if you choose, let's say, 150 master keys, that's say you get master keys three times in a row, the amount of master keys won't sum up to the amount of money that you just paid, so basically it's a scam. But mud is a con man. You have to think of it like that. Uh, so, ships. Ships are the thing that are the most valid for me, especially because they're account unlocked. Uh, so, what would I personally get? I would definitely get Kelvin Intel Dreadnought, Kelvin Pack 2, and Vulcan Scout Vessel. Okay, also, if you purchase a Mega Bundle, you can still purchase the normal bundle, however, the ships are going to be removed. For the same reason that I stated twice before, they are now account unlocked. 
so you can only purchase three different items. You can purchase the pack as many times as you want, but Mega Bundle can only be purchased once. And be mindful, if you purchase a normal bundle first, the Mega Bundle will disappear. So if you want a Mega Bundle, purchase the Mega Bundle first, then purchase normal bundle how many times you'd like. But if you're, you're going to be doing this, I think you would be better off just to go on to Zen Store and purchase the items by themselves. This is going to wrap this video up, crew. I really hope that you enjoyed, that you learned something new. And if you did, please leave a like, consider subscribing. My name is Captain Geronimo. This is what I do. Star Trek Online, ship reviews, gear reviews, Star Trek merch reviews, and many, many other things regarding Star Trek. As always, I love you all because you're the best. Geronimo, out.